Hey guys, Eric Kyle, your publisher, Great Lakes Scuttlebutt Magazine. I'm excited to be down to the Miami International Boat Show right here in beautiful South Beach, Miami. And I love this show, beautiful weather, great people having a blast. While I'm here, I'm kind of wandering around and I'm looking for some fun and exciting new products to report to you guys on. And my good friend, Tom Watson with E-Propulsion, how are you, sir? Good, man. How you doing, Kyle? It is always a pleasure. Thank you very much. Yeah, and Thanks you've got some by. exciting news for us. Tell us about what we're looking at here with this Elite. Well, we're looking at the, the our new E-Lite. It's our smallest, most compact motor. Um, it's really exciting. We well, had very fortunate to win the Innovation Award this morning here at the show. So Electric Propulsion, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, Innovation Award. And, uh, you know, the judges were really excited about something new that uh, really provided solutions for a lot of small craft and yeah. people that want portability. Yeah. yeah. So the neat thing about this is this is not like a, an engine that you have to slug over your shoulder and be able to take from craft to craft. This is a pretty small, compact, electric powered engine that can pretty much go anywhere. Anywhere. Go in the back of your car, go in a nice lazarette of your boat. Yeah. You know, it's just super convenient. And that was the the, the goal of this motor. Yeah. yeah. So if you were to say how many horsepower a motor like this would have, what would be your best guesstimate? Well, it's a 500 watt motor. So we say that's equivalent to about what a one and a half horsepower gas yeah. motor is. So a small gas motor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can use it for a lot of different applications. Tell us about what you're going to put this motor on. Well, right now you're seeing it on a stand up, uh, you know, stand up fishing Paddleboard, right, right. Perfect application for this. Both lightweight products. Portability is important. Yeah. Uh, inflatable, small inflatable boats. Mm -hmm. You know, eight to nine to ten foot yeah. would be a great source for. You know, some of those people might have a ten foot boat, and maybe they're going to have a ten or a fifteen horsepower motor on it. Yeah. But that's a lot if they're uh, putting a gas motor on and off. You know, that's a seventy to a hundred pound motor. Right, right. So uh, this motor weighs fifteen pounds. So that's it. That's fit. That's it. It's an actual outboard motor that weighs 15 pounds. Yes, 15 pounds. Wow. So this is this brand new technology? Are you guys breaking any new ground here? Or is this something that you've had in the hopper for a while? Or is this? Well, I, I would say it follows the technology of what we've had for the last 10 years. So yeah. it's got all of our safety features, battery protection features. So it has all of our technology, but we've just shrunk it down in this compact package. Yeah, I love that. So. You feel it when you give the throttle, the gentleman behind is giving a little throttle, you feel the torque on this. So it's not one of those things where it has to rev up, it's just your go. I'm feeling like I'm gonna get a shower right now, actually. <laughs> so that's the kind of power it's got. But, uh, but yeah, no, it's got great uh, capability, really responsive. We ran on about uh, seven or eight different kind of boats from inflatables to, to kayaks mm -hmm. to, uh, to these kind of boards, really responded really well. And I'll tell you something, the size of the market of guys that are out there using kayaks or these stand-up pedal boards that are also fishing boats, um, it's growing significantly, especially after COVID when we added so many new boaters. And at the entry level, a product like this would work really well for them. Yeah, and most of those guys were using some sort of pedal drive or yeah. paddles. Yeah. You know, maybe some of them found out that's a lot of work, but they still want to be on the water. Yeah. So this is a great solution. A lot of the kayaks, they have brackets that can go on them, mm -hmm. so you can put a little uh, motor on them. Uh, certainly on the inflatables, it can do the yeah. same thing, but you know, it's just a beautiful bit of quit, and it's super quiet. Show me how that comes out of there, or would you do it on this? Yeah, I think this I'll do it. I'll do it on this one because okay. we've got a protective cover on this yeah. one. But super easy. So it's got a release button on the side. You just okay. push that, and you lift it off. So and that's you're it. done. And you're done. Rack can stay on the on the uh, on the vessel. Right. It's got a little uh, multiple position handle. You kick it. Try that. Try that. I love it. Oh, that's light. That's really light. That's why it's called the E-Light. That is absolutely fantastic. I'll let you put it back on to show Good. the easy use of putting it back on as well. Tilt it up, slides onto a pin, and you're done. Now it's locked on. Fantastic. Yeah, tilt mechanism, tilts up. Really some of the best our engineers uh, in our constant development have come up with. So everything is right inside of here? Everything's here. The battery, battery the motor, included. everything. Everything's included. Okay, so yeah. tell me, how long is this going to last while I'm out there on the water? I know it depends on how much throttle I give it. Sure, but uh, this, ba this battery lasts 45 minutes at full power. Okay. This boat doesn't need full power. Right. It needs, you know, a third of the power to be effective. So, okay. you know, it's got 
two hours of range. And that's if you're going steady. Most people are going from place to place to place. Yeah. Maybe they're fishing or something like that. So the, uh, you know, it's gonna give you all day if you're just doing some fishing in a lake or a river. Perfect solution for anybody that's looking for a small horsepower outboard motor for their watercraft. Portable, I yeah, love portable. It. Good Tom, seeing you, my man. I appreciate it. Tell me All where right. I'm going to go online to find out more information about the products that you guys have to offer. ePropulsion.com. You made it pretty complicated, Tom. I'm sorry. <laughs> ePropulsion.com, guys. That's where you want to go find out more information about the e-light. It'll go on the next watercraft you own. Thanks so much. We'll see you out on the water.